Hi, my name is Jack Kieran from Skipper Buds at North Point Marina. I'd like to introduce you folks today a new brokerage listing, a 2009 60-foot Hatteras motor yacht sporting a 19.5-foot beam and C18 Caterpillar engines. The 60-foot Hatteras boasts a very large aft cockpit that you'll see with a table, a wraparound couch, the owner has supplied a couple of chairs, and then easy access to the engine room from here or the stern. As you enter the salon, you'll find a large seating area on the starboard side, a nice large flat screen television, and a couple of barrel chairs with a table in between. From the port side here, you'll see that there's staircases going up to the bridge, and then down below, we have a port side wraparound couch with their own television in the galley. On the stairs to the staterooms, of which there are three, you'll find that there's a wine chiller on the starboard side up next to the stairs here. The guest stateroom features two bunks, an upper and a lower, and then a large storage area below. Your uh, guest stateroom features a nice walk-around bed, a television, full storage, and access to the head through a door in the stateroom. This is a Jack and Jill head for the VIP stateroom as well as the guest stateroom with the door coming out into the hallway as well as the VIP stateroom featuring a nice stand-up shower and a sink. As you would expect on a 60-foot motor yacht, it has a washer and a separate dryer. And we've made it to the master stateroom where you're gonna see a large king-size bed you're going to have windows on both sides. You're going to have a flat screen television with both surround sound. And then you're going to find that we've got a huge closet, lots of storage. And this is a walk-in closet that features the audio visual as well as a safe and long hanging locker. The port side of the master stateroom features a vanity, all kinds of storage. And just when you thought you'd seen it all, we go into the master stateroom head that features two sinks as well as a full tub and shower. As we work our way up to the bridge, I'd also like to point out that we have a watertight door on the starboard side that feeds off to the bow or stern from the starboard side. There's a lot to talk about up here on the bridge. One thing that's super important is this is a glass instead of an isinglass. So Hatteras custom made the windshield to be a part of the hardtop. In addition to that, it's got cockpit heat and air conditioning up here. It works particularly well because of the fact that you don't have isinglass here. As we move to the dash, you've got a couple of G-Series Raymarine screens. You've got Caterpillar screens. You've got uh, the radio, VHF radio, and then of course music up here. This boat features the ABT track, which is a stabilizing system with fins. Most boats of this size don't have it, but this gentleman chose to have that. In addition to that, instead of just a bow thruster, you have a bow thruster, thruster and a stern thruster. And then your shifters and your throttles are built in here, your autopilot, and it's got duplicating VHF radios in case of a problem. A captain could not be happier with a stint seat as well as a stint companion seat for your co-pilot and perhaps another one or a bent. The bridge is expansive with a large wraparound red couch, a table, there's a refrigerator underneath here, and a grill underneath here. As you would expect, you have large stairs on the starboard side that lead to the aft cockpit, as well as the stairs that went to the galley. And this closes, so that once you're on the bridge, Closed, locked, so people can't come up, and keeps the air conditioning in. The aft deck bridge is large. You could put a couple chairs out here and do your own Corona commercial. As typical of all Hatteras's, the engine room is spectacular. This one boasts two C18 Caterpillar engines. Cummins generator has a little less than 1,300 hours on it, and the C18s have just a little less than 1,000, all fresh water use. The aft lazarette behind me features a door that comes through the swim platform and an expansive storage area. Thank you for taking the time to do the tour on this 2009 60-foot Hatteras. A couple of points I want to make one more time is that it's got a custom bridge with the uh, heat and air conditioning as well as the hard glass enclosure that was custom done by Hatteras. 
It's a freshwater boat with a little less than a thousand hours on it, and it's a beauty.